can't believe we're getting gear cream with a vindicator. So you girls in gear college or gear? Wow! Okay, sounds like a job for. Wow! What it is, guys? It's your boy Blast Miss HD, and today we are here to check out none other than Rick and Morty all after credit scene season number three now i'm gonna go through and do all of these and then put them all together and compile them so y'all go and watch them at once let's do this you know what i'm saying let go that's why i keep a backup i've got 17 pairs of nunchucks i always got them on deck every time turn up Is it ready? Yes. Is it? We What's can bring ready? it online now. Do it. Ooh, show you who's she, she kinda cute. Ah, smash her, man. I, I am Phoenix person. Phoenix person. Is that what we settled on? I thought we all agreed on Cyberbird. You said you didn't care what he was called, as long as we brought him back. Yeah, but Phoenix person? Fine. Who fuck the it. Fuck who is cares? A Phoenix <laughs> person! Uh, uh, Paul! Oh. Hello there. Nice doggy. You want a snack? You you want my unemployment check? You can tell the difference. <laughs> you want this one? But this is actual food, and this would nourish you. And this it's just paper that only has value to me. Unless my suffering is your nourishment. Oh Jesus, yep. okay. Yep, that's real. Oh <laughs> didn't even want that shit. Just wanted to hurt him. You'll never get away with this, <laughs> Concerto! That is where you're mistaken, Mr. Bruh, can you imagine hearing that shit after you just had a, a, a wolf come up and eat your unemployment check? What's really funny is I've been tested by animals before, man. I've had dogs try to attack me, nigga. I stopped. What's really hood? What's, what you got? What's up? You know what I mean? And it's really funny, bro. I've never had a dog when I've stopped looking at me and be like, hell yeah. Like, I I've never had it happen, bro. Every time I've ever stopped and confronted a dog, like, I don't yell or scream or nothing. I just stop, like, yeah, what's up? Go ahead and do it. The dog is like. The dog always leaves. Every time. I had this one dude sick his dog on me, and when I didn't run, fucking Rottweiler, matter of fact. Big ass fucking Rottweiler dog. Motherfucker ran up on me, stopped, and then kept doing this. <laughs> You know, kind of like human dudes do whenever they try to start some shit. And after it saw that it, I didn't care, I was still down. Like, yo, what's up? They did exactly what the human dudes do and decided, I guess, you know, all right, man, you lucky, man. You know what? <sighs> Next time. Mm -hmm. You better be lucky. But I'm leaving as well. Every time, bro. This shall be my greatest performance candy, of all time. Candy. Candy. This is it, Morty. We're goners. Ooh. We're not getting out of this one. After everything we've been through, this is how we're gonna die. Make peace with your god. Oh, jeez, Rick. Uh, I don't want to die. And now, for the E splat. <laughs> oh! What? What the, what the fuck is that? Who, who was that a man that, bird? Rick? That, Morty, is why you don't go to therapy. I can't believe we're getting gear That's cream real with a shit. vindicator. So you girls in gear college or gear? Wow! Okay, sounds like a job for Wow! I better go get into my alter ego. The homie thought he found some pussy, nigga. Homie was trying to smash! Bro, I swear to God, it's only so funny to me because I've had these conversations with females. Yo, so like, yeah, you know I mean, y'all, y'all in um is y'all in college or yeah, you know I mean, like what school y'all go to? Because you got you gotta be low-key with it. You can't ask them how old they is most of the time. Me, I just ask straight up, yo, let me see your ID. How old is you? You know what I mean? I don't play. I don't know why, but I genuinely don't like kids. I think they're they're terrible people. You know what I mean? I, <laughs> I don't like them. Ego. So cool. I know. Wait, what alter ego? He was already wearing the jacket. <laughs> ah! Got it. No one to hold him. And... Ah! Nick. 
Nigga! I tell you, fellas, this is the life. It certainly is. To freedom! Ooh, looks like a 422. Ooh, a couple cranks on the scaling knob with a four dillabyte crossfade would fix that up in a jiff. What? what? You'd be lucky to clear 13% demorphized with that kind of range. Gentlemen, gentlemen, what did we agree on? No, no work, work talk. talk! Let's just relax and enjoy our retirement. <laughs> what? Although what? only a handful of moon towers remain today, really? they were popular in the Skull! late 19th century. An entire town could be illuminated it's by- A random bird just swoops in on my nigga and just, man, See gets his ass. Thank you, Gunda! That person just died? Uh, yeah. Atlantis, baby! That was amazing! You got some of that mermaid puss! I'm really hoping it yeah. wasn't a one-off thing and I could see her again. By the way, hey, um, still not curious about what might have happened at that crazy Citadel place? <sighs> not at all, Morty. That place will never have any bearing over our lives ever again. Unlike that mermaid puss! <laughs> yeah! We're going back for yeah. seconds! We're gonna yeah. do that shit every week, man! That was Atlantis! Yeah. Shit. Rick? You know Hello, it's gonna be just wet! here for my putter. There's no such thing Jerry's mind as blowing? dry mermaid vagina. <laughs> Think about it! It makes perfect sense if you don't think about it too much. We're charged and aimed at Alpha Centauri, ready for transport. They fell for it! Let's send Gobo home! All right. Where's Dad? He should be here any second! It's funny, Jerry spent his life seeking attention, but in the end, humanity's instinctive dismissal of him saved an alien's life. He knows where to go, right? Yep, any minute now. Did it work? Did you guys get Gobo home? You have Gobo! You, you were supposed to bring him to the hill! As if! He was in your basket! He was in your car! No. Ugh. Ow! Oh! stuff. Hey, Jerry, it's Kiara. Listen, my boyfriend saw those texts you've been sending me, and he got pretty pissed off. If he calls you, just ignore him. This is Carmox. I have intercepted sexual communications between you and my new girlfriend, Kiara. I am coming to kill you now! Yo, Jerry, it's the big R. Uh, I killed that alien that was- Bruh, look. Never get mad at the dude. Hoes gonna be hoes. You cannot get mad at the dude and never go try to kill him or fight him. Unless he's openly disrespecting you and come like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? But if your female goes and smashes another dude, regardless of what she tells you, she went there to fuck. Don't listen to shit the bitch says about how old she it, it was hanging out and it just kind of happened. Oh, is this my work boyfriend? It was, oh my God, it's just a guy I'm friends with. Yo, he's just my friend. I don't know what happened and we just ended up kissing. Blah, 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 blah. Do not believe the bitch, you know what I'm saying? Now, when you find out that your hoe did cheat on you, don't get mad at the bitch. You just know what type of female she is, you know what I'm saying? It's like. I mean, don't be beating on the bitch and yelling and screaming and all this other bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, fuck her in the ass a couple times, you know what I'm saying? That'll teach her. Because, nigga, that's a, That'll be fight, nigga. <laughs> she gonna learn today! God damn, bitch! <laughs> you gonna learn today, bitch! <sighs> Bruh. I was coming after you. Looking out for you, buddy. Hey, Jerry, it's Rick. Don't be mad. I fucked your ex-girlfriend, Kiara. Who are you talking to, Rick? What? Then my boyfriend saw the... Uh. Oh. Oof. Dibs on his stuff. Dibs on his stuff. Hey, Jerry, it's Kiara. Listen, my boyfriend saw those texts you've been sending me, and he got pretty pissed off. If he calls you, just ignore him. This is Carmox. I have intercepted sexual communications between you and my new girlfriend, Kiara. I am coming to kill you now! Yo, Jerry, it's the big R. Uh, I killed that alien that was coming after you. Looking out for you, buddy. Hey, Jerry, it's Rick. Don't be mad. I fucked your ex-girlfriend, Kiara. Who are you talking to, Rick? Doesn't matter. Hey, Jerry, this is Michael down at the Antique Phone Rentals. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and let you off the hook for the $70 late fee. You can go ahead and keep that answering machine. Nobody really uses those anymore except for exposition on TV shows anyways. Ooh, wee! What a season! Sorry I never showed up, but I got married, I had a baby, I went back to school, I got my GED. -E what did you do while you were waiting? Hopefully you didn't just f around and waste your life. Ooh, wee! See ya for season four in like a really long time. I, I might even have a big white Santa Claus beard and a can and a. And a. And a, and a 
couple of grandkids and all that kind of stuff. See you, see you then. I love how my nigga just keeps it real, bro. This is season four. God, tomorrow's career day. I don't want to think about what I do when I get out of school. I know exactly what I want to do. I want to work in hospice. I want to comfort the people who are dying, who have no one else in their lives. She's trying Real to come. Real lonely people. I'm going to look at their name tags and I'm going to say, I love you. Followed by whatever it says on their name tag. Over and over. What the f***? She sound horny. Hey, Morty, quick favor. What, cover me in gasoline and spiders? Fine, yeah, I'm in. Yes, you're down? Wasn't my first pitch, but hey, I'm not going to waste this opportunity. I'm mad at it. That sucks. Rick, did you take the tapatio? Hmm, Globa fan. Nope. Thanks, I could never lift it up. No problem. I'll be able to drink water for weeks because of you. It's just part of my job, ma'am. Breaker 1-9, this is Jerry Smith. Just finished my first delivery of the day. 900 more to go. The fuck? Ooh-wee! Big storm coming! Ooh-wee! Big storm coming! Could be a twister. Mm-hmm! Hey, Rick, can you walk me through something? Yeah, what are you thinking? So, you and Morty knew you needed my help, but you weren't sure I was good enough at karate, so you hired my grad students to attack me? Yep. But it was an emergency, Rick. How long did that take? It actually took less training than you'd think. Your students all shared a pretty keen aptitude for martial arts. I don't know if that's by coincidence or if there's some correlation with their passion for African-American women's studies. Maya Angelou did personify both acquiescence and perseverance. Ooh-wee. That's exactly the kind of connection I'd have loved to explore in my class. Too bad I lost my job for putting my students in the hospital. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about that. Wow. Mm-hmm. Niggas ain't your friends. Niggas ain't your friends. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Now that's what I call dragon. What? It's a joke. You're a dragon dragging your stuff. I understand. So, how you doing? I grow weary of you humans. How about 50 bucks? You're weary of 50 bucks? I'm trying to cheat on my wife. I'm looking for a little magic, a little fantasy. What? You can use some help. Let's help each other, huh? 50 bucks. <laughs> Slot! Nice. Is there a reason you can speak? Yeah, and I'm ashamed of it. Then speak of it no more. Do you wish to eat? Maybe bond a little? Yeah, I could bond. How long does it take you to fly to Florida? What the fuck? What the fuck? It's the dragon fucking the, the cat? So the dragon's fucking the cat. And the human. Is it bad? I've literally had, I've, I kind of don't want to tell this story because it happened like two weeks ago. But I had a dude give me that same proposition at the casino. I really don't want to tell the story. <laughs> I think about it. I might tell the story at the end, man, because it's it's fucked, man. I don't I don't want to tell, tell people this disgusted shit. Hey, man, you uh, I'm looking for a place to stay, huh? I, you know, I may be thinking, you know, I could, uh, you know. Bro, I, I dropped my nunchuck because of thinking of that shit. Man, I just want to open my Christmas presents. Well, I'm waiting on you to finish those snake costumes. I'm almost done. You know what? They, they're good enough. I'm done. All right, let's go. All right, we're landing. Come on. Man, I can't believe we're almost done, Rick. I can practically taste the eggnog. Hey, you know what? I, I feel like we're forgetting something. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks for reminding me. Morty, next time stay in the car. 
Damn, bro. Tired of the same boring adventures with your dog shit Morty? Yeah! Oh, jeez. Then get ready for the Citadel of Rick Story Train. Story Train. Story Train. The Citadel of Rick Story Train comes with car after car of enemies, lovers, and Goombi, all grappling with the nature of who you truly are. Rick is a god. Tickets, please. Whoa, watch out. It's Story Lord. Damn, he's Jack. Pure Thumb Gutter. And of course, what story what? would be complete without the engineer of the Did greatest story ever gutter? told? Oh, Jesus Christ. I have come not to judge the world, but to save it. And the best part is the fun never ends. Thanks to the Rick patented anthology generator you'll never run out of new stories and people to tell them are they alive of course but not in any ways that matter they have no soul puppets of fate the story train available now in the citadel of ricks buy it ironically buy it sincerely just buy it not buying it is an act of buying it buy it now look it up it's real www.story-train.com on the internet it's there buy it buy the train we want you to buy the train look at your dad such a dork keeping bees I mean, it's at least it's interesting, though. At least, like, I wish my dad kept bees. I mean, it's kind of cute. Like, your dad keeps bees. How old is your dad? Just fuck him already, He's damn. obviously beekeeping age. I don't know. I think it's kind of sweet. Summer, I want to f*** your dad. Oh, really? Yeah, I couldn't go. I, bro, why did I know that? Uh, our next guest. That's bad Davis, that I. Well, actually, very little information. Uh, besides the fact that he is uh, impervious to acid. So here he is. He's here to prove it. Acid? Let's welcome this guy. What? Let's do Ooh. this shit. Now you're uh, you're sure about this? Eat my. I poison. did not know that ass was on the menu. <laughs> Don't what? steal my moment. Do uh, it. Steal my moment. Do it. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, then without further ado, drop him. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Burn his ass. Burn his ass. Yeah! Yeah! Yep. Looks like I'll be eating ass flambe. Please kill me. Planets own. Planets, entire eyes, systems Ooh, this is steamy, sexual. lush globes, and Ooh, barely that planet habitable full of celestial objects are Ooh, drifting that planet, through the void just for you. Planets only. Let's turn Got something a little bit bigger. <laughs> me, I, like, yeah. mm, I came too long. There's I don't want no short game. Oh, shit. There's a hole in her ozone. You? I can't fill it by myself. I'm not smart enough. Young, dumb, and orbiting a sun. The greenhouse is in what? perfect at planets only. Oh, what you split my... What type of nasty shit? What the fuck? What? I just heard some of that What? What? What am I hearing? I'm scared. Planets own. Planets own. Planets Entire own. systems of steamy, lush globes and barely habitable celestial objects are drifting through the void just for you. Planets only. Let's terraform or colonize me as I am. Planets oh. only. Oh, shit. There's a hole in my ozone. I didn't put it there, did you? I can't fill it by myself. I'm not smart enough. Young, dumb, and orbiting a sun. The greenhouse is in full effect at planets only. Oh, I want you to split my Pangea into distinct continents. I don't have hydrostatic equilibrium yet. Is that something you can learn? You yeah. idea. What? <sighs> I was watching over your shoulder for a full minute. So I was watching because it's funny. It's, it, 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 they're, they're planets, but they're sexy. It's a comedic premise. Yeah. Planets only. Planets only. All right, guys. So I never knew that there was a, a intergalactic planet sex hotline but you guys heard it here first folks make sure to call 1-800 planets only anybody out there trying to split a planet's tectonic plates you know so that the eruption can happen because tectonic is volcano volcanic uh but yeah because there's a hole in in a female planet's ozone layer and she's not smart enough to fill it herself <laughs> oh god <laughs> Smart enough to fill it herself. Smart on the planet, baby. Whoopee. We're going to edit that whoopee out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The boy Blasphemous HD. Make sure to donate to the GoFundMe. I can buy more equipment, more cameras, fix the damn internet. Yes. 
Oh, God. Also, I want to thank everybody who has been donating. You know what I mean? First off, let me go thank the people. I want to thank the people that's been, that has been donating, because it's been, you know what I mean? Oh, my God. What the? You know what? You guys are funny. I swear to God, I'm sick of how I... I swear to God, you guys piss me off how funny you guys are. I swear to God. So far, my highest uh, two donators at the time is Brian Cummings. At, so you can see it, so you know I'm not just making this shit up. This is not me just making this shit up. Brian Cummings coming in first with a donation of 500 bucks. Thank you, Brian Cummins. I really, really hope that is really your last name. You must got a lot of bitches, bro. I know you get a lot of bitches with that name. Uh, also, uh, thank you, PJ Douglas for the $100 donation. Skylar Wheeler for the $20 donation. Brian Cummings for $500 donation, bro. I appreciate you, yo. Bro, like, if stuff keep going like this, I'll be able to have internet. I'll be able to watch porn, uh, 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 internet, you react to internet videos, not, not Pornhub again. You know, that place is, 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 is horror, horror. So Hunter German, thank you for the donation, bros. Thank you for the donation to $10, bro. I really appreciate you, bro. Adrian Flores, Nico, I appreciate you for the uh, $20 donation. Jordan Morgan, thank you for the $500 donation, bro. I really appreciate you, bro. Like, I really appreciate you, bro. Tia Moore with the $200 donation. Yeah, you know I mean, like I like you just, you know, I'm she knows. Uh Blair English with the $35 donation. I appreciate you, bro. Jared Blankenship with the $20 donation. Appreciate you. Anonymous with the 50. He ain't even wanna be known, but he still sent 50 bucks. I appreciate you. I'ma put that shit in my gas tank, shorty. I also want you guys to know that some of this money will be going towards hot Cheetos. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I ain't gonna play with y'all. But Hot Cheetos equipment and pouring her uh, 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 puffs. Cause y'all heard the P. I said I said something else, but I'm gonna edit that out. Thank you, Griffin Burt, for the fifteen dollar donation, bro. An another anonymous for another ten dollars. Mason Turner for fifteen dollars. Kim Ren Alexander. Thank you for the twenty dollars, bro. I appreciate you, Matthew McDonald. I appreciate you for the ten dollar donation. Tia Moore right now is in first place currently. She has donated a little bit over a thousand dollars, but I appreciate everybody who's been donating, bro. I'm gonna make a video going through every single person who's donated and like saying something nasty or derogatory or possibly a combination of the both of them, but leaving out the nasty part because I don't want, I don't, I don't, y'all might not deserve that unless you do, but then it's Miss Jackson if you're nasty. <laughs> she knows. Miss Jackson can still get taken down, huh? I mean, Janet Jackson can still get the, you know, can still get pregnant -fized. I appreciate all of you guys. I'm gonna keep on making vids. My most important thing is just getting my internet fixed. That's what I really wanna, really, really, really wanna do is get my internet fixed. And with you guys' help, we're on our road to that. I appreciate you guys. We're already one third of the way to our $10,000 goal. And I just released this video four hours ago. You guys are amazing. I would give y'all hot Cheetos if I didn't only have 17 bags left. You know, <laughs> Twism.